Hello everybody, and welcome to the latest Worlds of ZZT livestream, where today, for this lovely Friday, we're going to be checking out some more Code Red. Good news is, unlike every other multi-week stream I've ever done, we're starting from scratch again today, thanks to this game having eight different endings. We managed to get one last week, and now we're going to have to find ourselves on a different path. So let's just kind of jump right to it. Alexis Jansen, 1993, classic of ZZT. You, you heard it all before. You know this. If you don't know this, you'll, you'll figure out soon enough that this is, this is quite the game. We've heard this. We've seen this. It's registered. That's something. Everybody loves a good code red. Normal 16-year-old. Eventually we turn on the TV and... Things happen. Sorry to interrupt the music. I think I do 40s these days. That'll do. We will register this shareware. We have to let the beat drop once. All right, we're going to try and take it a little different this time. We remain Kyle Lipschitz, average 16-year-old who does not like his alarm clock. Really wish he stayed in bed. After all, there is no school on Saturday. Last time, we kind of just broke everything. Also, by that Tracil save, I realized at the last second... I would have ended up overwriting my save for that game, which is also in, in mid-progress. So I saved myself there. We're going to be a good boy this time. We're going to try and not break pretty much everything we touch. Let's just see if we can go back to bed. Okay, we do have to get dressed. This is why so many ZZ games force you to get dressed. Do we need to pick up our gun? We don't, but you know what? We are going to need it. Well, let's get our rifle. I promise not to shoot in the house. I'm not allowed to, see? We're not going to talk to our brother down there because talking to him apparently counts as hitting him. I'm not sure if we actually hit him. Or he's just a mean faker, but... Similarly, we're not going to explode this computer? Let me just print this article this time. Oh, nope. Isn't there a printer? Isn't there? Yeah. There we go. Printing. I'm honestly surprised there's no sound effect here. You have to press a button on the printer after we clicked print? This is a bad printer. That's a printer sound, though. Wow. Yep, there you go. Our own, our very own home printed scroll. Mutations in City Zoo. Toxic waste is believed creator of the many strange mutations at the City Zoo, says the head zookeeper. They are highly poisonous, and many are almost invincible. Weapons are kept on hand that can destroy any of them, so no one should be worried. Thing from the Daily Moon, July 4th, 1992. That's gotta be a rough zoo. I don't know how many zoos have guns. Or other weapons in case the animals mutate. We can't just go outside, can we? No. We gotta get the key. Now this time, because we did not hit our brother, our brother is not here. But maybe Mom will be a little nicer. Now she's going straight to talking about the news, which we didn't watch yet, so she's going to tell us all about it. All of Southern California is going to become a toxic waste dump. She's written a very nasty letter, and she would like me to deliver it. I don't know about that. I just want some breakfast, man. It's Saturday. I do not want to... do not want to work. No microwave or anything? Beneath the sink, you find a water... Did I get that last time? All 
All right, now the door exploding, that's kind of just how it is. I just eat something out of the cupboards? And, like, I got... Okay, that set a flag. We've eaten some food. That's all we really wanted. Now we're just going to take our frying pan and go back to bed, I think. Sorry, Mom. The postal workers can wait. Yawn. You sleep for what seems like ages. You wake up and turn to look at your alarm clock. You smashed it, silly you. By the looks of the sky out of your window, it's past dinner time. Good God. I mean, I guess that's what being a teenager was like. Let's see if it's past... Wait, I didn't... Is this my dad? Dad? Daddy dude, that's right. Okay. Dad, you're really late for work. You're leaving at dinner time. There were some candles put out. Can we... Does anything change here? Doesn't really look it. We are later in the day. As you can see, it's night. Mom doesn't care. My best friend Jane Lemonhead has been playing Super Nintendo in my house since morning. I guess I can just... Go outside. I just hope this doesn't start the same path, because that's how that all went down last time. We got the, the mob showed up. Oh, okay, the car changed color. All right, we can't open the letter. But now that it's nighttime, Slip the letter inside the mailbox and flip up the flag. Your friend Jay's car from next door drives up, and they insist that you come with them to the nearby We Couldn't Think of a Better Name Amusement Park. Oh joy. Get in, but this time not threatening. Thank you, Jay. You're actually a pal. Oh, we gotta change files. We're on a new path. Love this little password animation here. That's fantastic. Hello, I will give you your password for Code Red Part 2. Let me write this ginormous thing down. 1, 2, 0, 4, 3, Jeb! Everybody's always yelling Jeb. Remember, this is for Part 2. All right. Forward. Code red. File two. Nah. Well, I did a very bad job changing that. I think did I just not finish that. I don't know. That's not the point. The point is we have to enter our five digit password. 12043. They've changed it in a different directory? I don't know. Oh god, and now... Okay, I think the letters actually are for our stats. So, like, yeah, see, we should have our gun with us as we go to the amusement park. Which will be good, in case they have any mutant animals. I honestly don't think I've ever gone this path. I know there's an amusement park, but I don't think I've ever been here. You ride in the back of Jay's van as you drive to the nearby. We couldn't think of a better name amusement park. But she's proud of that joke. Look at this gorgeous scrolling. What happened to the road? Why did the road just fall to pieces? Lovely font. We got all kinds of stuff here. Rides, games, shop, shows, the works. Turnstile. Binnable. Yeah. Good game. This is why this game is so famous. Does this cost money? I feel like I should have money before I go to an amusement park. Okay, somebody bought me a ticket. Thank you. My friends really should stop leaving me, though. Oh, now hold up. 
here we have some authentic STK. We got green on dark green. I don't think you can get that any other way. Interesting. Right, we've only got two exits. Let's let's not follow them. If they don't want to hang out with me, then I'll get a hot dog all by myself. This is a great board. I'm loving the vibes of this one. This is a great end of summer game. Hello, sir. I'm Albert Lim, your friendly amusement park hot dog salesman. Would you like to buy a hot dog? Only two gems. I don't have two gems. Oh, I was supposed to steal my brother's money. But I didn't because I was being a good boy. And now, now I can't get a hot dog. I wonder if I can actually, like, do all of this. Aw, stray cat. Well, we're gonna find out. Nice Kyle only. Nothing ventures this way, just a bunch of shops and food vendors. Why don't we go on some rides? Okay. Maybe somebody will, like, lose their change in a loop-de-loop -loop or something. What is this? This section of the We Couldn't Think of... Oh, it's that music, too. We Couldn't Think of a Better Name Amusement Park is currently under construction. Please watch your step. Have a nice day. No, this doesn't look like it's a puzzle. It looks like I can just... Well, not the end. Okay, so maybe there is a puzzle here. I'm picking stuff up. Canisters. Most of this is all blocked off, though. Good arrangement of, like, detritus. Okay, well, we can't buy a hot dog, but we can steal a worker's lunch. You earn five health from the food when you eat it. You also find a rubber band. You take it. Now we got some dessert. Jackhammer? Oh, heck yes. Hold up. Save. Or... Okay. okay, this is this looks like it's actually a puzzle. Let's just go nuts. I'm expecting some good sound here. Has no fuel. Okay. Let's try hooking the rubber band up between the peg and the wooden board. I don't know what the point of that was. It's... I can move this thing up and down? I don't know why I'd want to do that. What is this puzzle? Uh, seem to be in trouble here, actually. Unless I can get this cat out of the way. Can't afford a hot dog. Oh! Sorry, I've misbehaved. Free hot dog! Wow, Kyle, okay. Sorry, I think Nice Kyle is over. <laughs> We're just gonna steal some hot dog stove fuel. God, I love teenage writing. What kind of fuel do they use for this? You know, the hot dog fuel. It can also power a jackhammer. Fill it with fuel. Good animation. And, and a good use of how line walls kind of break when you bust them up a bit. Is this... Authentic water. I wonder... I feel like this is an object pretending to be water. There's so many boulders here, this seems like I should be pushing boulders in, like it's Chip's challenge. Well, so much for that. Ah, nuts.
All right. Now that I'm done painting the puzzle, we can go forward. There's a door here. Sign that says to store or destroy all waste materials before opening. Oh. Am I supposed to use the jackhammer? Seems like I can only put it in two spots. And even if I do this, that's not going to be any help. Supposed to. Would it have made a difference if I broke this? Not really, it shouldn't. Hmm. There's no way out from here if I push a boulder out. I'm already getting stumped. These are boulders, right? Must be boulders. Honest to goodness boulders? Well, I can't shoot here anyway. Right? I, I mean, I opened the walkthrough in advance here. Let's see. No, hot dog doesn't show up in the walkthrough. The amusement park. Uh oh, this looks like it's cut off. Also, it doesn't help that I'm seeing text that says, if you know the answer to this damn puzzle, email me in a walkthrough. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'm not a fan of this. I think this might... I think we might have softlocked by going here. To get past the stray cat, we're supposed to give it the fish bones that we get if we, like, just destroy that fish in our house. But I can't go back to the house. It's the kind of game that's going to take anybody, like, years to figure out entirely by themselves. Alright, I'm just going to look up the flag. We got the fish bones last time. We had to, like, repair the gas line. Then use the pan to cook the fish. Do a really bad job of it. What flag are we after here? Fish bone. Easy enough. Okay, well, the stray cat will strut. Oh, where are you going, kitty? Dang. Okay. Gone, gone. This board is art. The lively carousel. Completely unmoving, completely static. I wonder if you could do a kind of carousel animation. I feel like this is a good starting point. If you use line walls, you could have them move up and down. Maybe if you like changed characters and had like the horned one go from the middle to the left and then the right, something like that, you might. I don't know how good that would look, but it might be something to try. Instead, this carousel is not particularly lively, but it does have its own musical theme. This also looks great. Bozo D. Mad Clown's Funhouse. Oh yeah, look at that. Or That's some real SDK there, Dark Red. You know it.
Watch out for the evil clowns and their partners, the Flying Eyeballs. Sure. Where did that ruffian come from? How do we deal with evil clowns? Oh, with way too many bullets. Oh, I didn't even realize we were shot limited there. Don't miss. I missed. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, code red with this yellow bordered room? For shame, what is this? Killer snakes. And what is this? I feel like me streaming this game is going to end up tarnishing its legacy. Oh my god, Jansen, please. That's good, I doubt, yeah. I will be able to just get to the green. Okay. This isn't too bad. I feel like it's just a couple, like, horizontal and vertical lines. Let's just see. Yeah, that's nothing. That I can deal with, but, uh... This is not... You know... The finest ZZT game ever made. You don't show people this board and say, yeah, people paid money for this, actually. Now this. Cool, remember when I screwed this up so bad in Nightmare that I had to, like, go back to it in a later stream? I'm gonna guess we're gonna end up with a full set of keys to get through this fun house. The good news is that's the only one of these that actually takes me anywhere. Let's see. That's still nothing. Now I get... Oh, okay. I wanted to go up from there. Can I get out of here? Oh, boy. Uh oh. My gosh. Oh. Okay. Well, I didn't get stuck. Let's go. Let's go up from here. I'm sure I'm gonna need this. Probably for that bottom one to connect it with something. Oh, but how will I get... Okay, the left, yeah. Once again, back outside. More of these sliders. How do I get into this room? Let me just look at this. I can't go from... There's three transporters in that room. The leftmost one won't work from the other side. Oh, but I think it might from the very top. Let's see if I can get in from the top. I think that's how that works. Yeah. Okay, so the next goal then is to find out how to get to the exit, which, no, not quite from there. So it looks like I have to do that from here, from towards the lower right, which I can get into. I think I want to go into the, the transporter facing the right that's just above me. Which means going through this one, through here, I've definitely, yeah, been here. 
Okay. All right. That wasn't too bad. Now what is this? Team. The lower left of the funhouse. I mean, to be fair, every Alexis Jansen song sounds familiar. Just because some other ZDT game inevitably grab this. Oh wait, this does sound familiar. Familiar though. I got a brief moment where I thought it was might as well be walking on the sun. I don't even know if that's like out by this point. It's a little fast. All right, let's let's figure out what we're supposed to do here. Okay, so those are just kind of ricochets essentially. Blue ones are moved with switches. Then there are some actual ricochets. The purple down arrow is a drill. When shot, it will move whatever is below it. There's cyan and yellow. Is there a white key in here, or is it just the two? It looks like it's just the two. You don't really get a lot of boards. That's the music. Is this anything? Oh boy. Alright, this is an impressive song. I know this is going to get kind of annoying if we really go for rope. Let's just keep this nice and quiet. Alright, so I need to shoot a lot of breakables. Okay, the pushers do the work. So this bottom breakable... I can move this switch. Don't know how to do that. Oh, this looks like it will destroy a breakable. Yes. Okay, we'll hit a switch here. This is kind of neat. I like this puzzle. So this one will get me that breakable once I move that, at least. That's what the last one's going to do. This one won't do anything. That ends. Right, let's see. I hope... I hope that was good. This is kind of brutal. I don't know, I just go for broke and see what happens, but I, I can tell that doing it like this is like the most likely way to break something. Does this always move? Does it go back and forth? Okay, that moved down. Will this make it move down again? Okay. This is... Okay, that gets rid of another drill. Alright, having the music this quiet ain't half bad. Let me know, though, if it is, like, bugging y'all.
I just figure this sort of thing is also kind of miserable to have complete silence for. The game is doing nightmare before nightmare. I want to hit the breakable that's far right of here. But nothing... Nothing seems to be pointing to it. Can't be shot from the left or right or below or above. I'm making a panicked look at the walkthrough just in case this is one of the bugs. No, looks good. This is brutal. Okay, then. I feel like I'm making progress. Yeah, I learned what all the switches do. Let me see here. Bottom switch. The bottom switch. This one up and down. Kate's gonna be here in a sec, so I'm gonna end up muting myself. Or maybe that's not him out there, but he's supposed to be home soon. That's obviously not going to help. Move that down. I have to hit that purple arrow up top. Up left. Straight down to the right. Up. That moves it to this breakable. That gets tied up with this, with this one pusher. Break something was yeah, this was always here, blocking me from going forward. I think. This switch. I don't see the left. Oh, okay, that actually I think is important. No, I can't figure out how to get this... The middle red breakable on the right half. That has to go away. But nothing lines up with it. Was this the puzzle they couldn't figure out? I'm now worried. Yeah, this walkthrough looks like it's mangled or something. I'm 
Let's see, does it look like this on Z2? Okay, yeah, the song got screwed up here when this got put on the museum. So if you have the solution to the transporter maze, email me. This also, no, there's just something really screwy with this. Okay. Thank you, I'm glad you like it. I, I'm gonna zap past this. It feels broken. I'm not 100. We're gonna be here a while, otherwise, wow, that feels so loud, even though that's what the volume was before. I will look into this. I, I'm actually very curious. I feel like this is not solvable. It's like... Fuck in here. I want to shoot this. Which, this doesn't line up. This way doesn't line up. This way doesn't line up. Neither does this way. Nothing seems to be able to hit this. this pusher to go out of the way, because I need a bullet to go left from here. Down, right, left, up, left, yeah, this one. Because this just hits the pusher. I wonder if that's just off by one and was supposed to be one tile down? I don't know. Okay, I was gonna... Did I joke, or was I going to joke that this is doing all of Nightmare's puzzles years before Nightmare? But again, looking pretty Nightmare here. Now these colors, all the fancy ones, are look like they're from things. That's ammo for Dark Cyan, torches or bears for the brown. What is the deal with this room? There's nothing going on. Exit. And I was supposed to get the other keys except for white. Is there a white door here? No, okay. I, f I feel like that's really been a huge, a huge thing since I started the museum and writing and playing all this stuff, like, publicly. It's just, like... There's no way anybody ever beat Sivian. I'm I'm 100% convinced. 100% convinced. This one's got eight endings, so maybe nobody's gotten them all. I mean, I got one last week. But even that one, what, did have a programming error? And it looks like this one does too? And that's, I mean, that's two for eight, or a quarter of the way through them. Time for a relaxing roller coaster, right? Oh, thank goodness, we're getting some zuts. Sometimes this is all you need. This is a very relaxing roller coaster by roller coaster standards. Where's the Defunct Land video on this one? I'm gonna outrun this roller coaster. Yeah, it's still going. What happened to my friends? Did they have to go through all this? Did they solve this puzzle? Did they rig it so I couldn't? Ah, well, we did. We did stop an alien invasion last time. I think it's always an alien invasion.
Hmm, strange that a transporter beam would be hidden in such an obvious place. Oh, this is... Oh, I love this guy. I want... I want to sync the colors. I want this to look pretty. Yeah, there we go. Alright, I guess we're gonna transport. On to a space station. Let's go. For the hell of it. I have no idea where I'm going now. Oh, what nice doors. Good doors in space. Not for a key card. Okay. That's probably my way out. That looks like a hangar door I can crash into if I've ever seen one. Well, if left, or if right is the exit, then left. Could be. Computer? APSS controls. Amusement park space station. Are we still in the amusement park? Is this all just a hoax? This won't go well. Fingerprint reader? Hand reader? Stick your hand on the plate, an alarm goes off, and a security laser fries you, ending your life. Oops. Okay, I do like it delineating the controls we can interact with. This is all... Oh, hang on. Okay, apologies for that delay. Time to stick my finger in something. Ouch. I don't know... I don't know what my goal is here. Last time we learned about an alien invasion. This time... Oh, I, I can't wait to figure out what this thing does. It's a Bunsen burner, 2001. From the future. Push the button to start the experiment. I guess that's a success. I'll now stretch in celebration. I'll, I'll give you all an ad break. I'll be right back. It'll be a short one. Alright, I don't know what that experiment was for other than to look cool. A crash can full of plastic gloves and hypodermic needles. This one just feels very all over the place. A book of medical, or oh, sorry, a medical book of liquids and such. Hydrocene, Bacocene, Cyantine, Yestal blood, Full salt, Yeshtone. Okay. Blue wakes up people. I'm just gonna let's let's not get ourselves. Blue equals coma wake up. Oh, I think they're all actually color coded by name. It sounds like the G one is green. Yeah. Well, no. One of these has. To, well, I guess the blood is red. Cyan is... okay, I guess I need to... Green is the old blue stuff. Cyan equals painkiller. Awake, no sleep. I can't wait to find out what 
what kind we're doing with all these drugs. Yell stole blood. Is named for blood. The blood of a Yelty. Go to sleep. There we go. The three pronouns. He, she, it. Full salts. Concentrated caffeine used on very rare occasions. I feel like all of these things being made up here would, like, sell very well. Yeah, thank you for the sub marbles. We got some yesh tone. These mysterious liquids sound delicious. They, well, the one that puts you to sleep sounds delicious to me. I'll take that one. Okay. This one, yesh tone, will make your skin turn yellow. The only reason most planets outlaw it is that it makes the patient feel like his skin is literally on fire. That's I'm really excited for what we're going to get into here. All right, so that's all of those. I don't I don't know what I'm supposed to concoct here. Wash my hands. Oh yeah, we'll we'll get you that. Let's see if I can figure out what this puzzle is and then we'll 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 make you a guy of sorts. You pick up the hypodermic needle. This game predates edible vomit, predates nightmare. Very formative. Red key card. Okay. I don't know what I need this for yet. Well, let's let's make marbles a, a something. How about we do another guy? Everyone likes a good guy. This one the 4.0? Nope. This one the 4.0? This looks right. Alright, yep, still can't make women. That's the one. Alright. Marble mustache, for sure. Goatee? No. Just the mustache. Sideburns? Nah. Tank top. Oh, I think I did tank top. Excuse me, last time. That's okay. How about... See, we can see our faux STK colors here. We'll do some dark cyan, and maybe we'll see a flicker of ammo for, like, a frame. There it is. Skin. Alien Green. He's looking kind of like Igor from Hugo's House of Horrors. How about those classic nun, nun eyes? Oh, yes, actually, you can get some shades. Have some shades. Yeah. This guy's popular. No more. Any other hairstyles? I think we did the coif last time. What's... What is regular hair? Sure. Let's see. What would go good with green skin? Gray, blonde, brown. Also green, I guess. There we go. I, I guess you got a vegetable guy. That's a guy for sure. Thank you for the sub. Enjoy your guy. And back to the code red. Is this... if this isn't really a puzzle if the sliders are changing directions. I don't feel like it.
No, this is still a puzzle, and I screwed it up. As one does. Hold up, I need to be able to... I need to move stuff more to the right than anything else. I'm on my way, yeah. I hope that it was cool to just run that experiment and also leave it running. I think this is about this is like a Bunsen burner. I should probably shut this off. No? Okay. Alright, last direction then. Okay, crew quarters. Got a red key. Is this red? Sure hope that's what I'm supposed to use this on. Oh wait, first we gotta check the plant. It's a pretty green fern. Garbage. Search. What? Junk, trash, garbage, the usual. Yeah, see? Alright. Oh, okay, yes, this is the captain. Search him, wake him, shoot him, inject him with the hypodermic needle. Oh, man. Okay, well, now we know what we need our drug. What am I supposed to do here? I guess I can give him the one that makes him super fall asleep? I mean, really, it's no more irresponsible than shooting him. You shoot him. Unfortunately, you missed the brain. He wakes up and instantly fries you with his laser pistol, then flops down on the bed, dead. Unfortunately, so are you. I'll well, draw game. I'm assuming he's gonna just be mean no matter what, even if we don't start with violence. Yeah, okay, security laser. We sizzle. We die. I'm guessing I'll wake him up unintentionally if I search. Mm-hmm. Same thing. All right. What what drug do we give this man? I'm gonna assume that it's the the blood one because that's the one that's supposed to make you sleep for a long, long time. I'm also worried now that we're gonna like continue to use this needle and stab other people with it. Don't do that. Why does only one of them have disease if they're if this one's asleep too? Alright, here goes nothing. Okay. You do so and then toss it into the trash can. The captain just rolls over and sleep. There we go. Oh wow. Whoa, this dude is loaded. Ammo, gems, a pocket knife, a computer disc, the gloves he's wearing, his key ring, his green key card, his captain's badge, the piece of paper in his pocket. I feel like we can get all of this now that he's just this asleep. 15 ammo. Three gems. Oh, I love how this is all drawn out. Pocket knife. Let's see what this looks like. Wow, good knife. That's a knife. Computer disc. CZT, disc one of one. High density. Oh, it's the Software Visions disc. These are all their games. That's great. There's no third file to code red yet. That's lovely. Gloves? This is, well, I mean, this would be charming if I didn't, like, inject this man with chemicals. Empty, an empty key ring. Key card. Captain Ewing. All right, let me write this down next. 87, 12, 53, 56. Did 
I doubt the rest of this matters. Eight o'clock Tuesday. Yeah, then all that's all fives. So that's nothing. Is there blood on the corner? Why is there something on the corner? Oh, a coffee stain. Okay. All right. I'm glad I did that right. I honestly, I want to see this in the editor. I want to know what the other drugs do to him. Here's the reward. All right, what can we do to this poor guy? Inject a bubble of air into his blood. God, I was going to, like, say that that's an option also, but that also sounds awful. Take the liquid into his blood. He rolls over and wakes up. Can't wake up. All right, it seems like the rest just kind of don't do what they need to do. This mate, this is the first ZZT game I've ever seen in which you can inject air into somebody's veins. So that's this. I'm not sure what I do with the control room. That had a white. Oh, here's the white. Ah, okay. I thought this was just supposed to be sci fi electronic stuff. It's just another puzzle that you can just do this in. Jet's looking good. Engine and life support. Yeah, okay, we're getting consistent rocket ships. Guns. Front and side guns. Nose cones. It works. Was Sorry, I didn't save a planet or anything here. I just kind of gave a man drugs. Maybe the aliens will return from your revenge. You'll have ten years to prepare. You plan to use it to its potential. Was this right? What if I didn't have this key? They will return. Again, I didn't... I really don't think I was supposed to use the white key there. Yeah, that's our ending screen. Oh, did I really save on this board? Was it a different save? Okay. I'm bad about this. Okay, we're back here. I guess we're at our ending, then. This is a bit of a shorter path. I guess, admittedly, I did skip a puzzle that I think is broken. I probably would have been there for a while, even if it's not. I got... Well, no, I have a key card, is the thing. Is this gonna at least, like... Oh, well, even, even still, like... Nothing on this ship has indicated that these aliens are trying to take over Earth. Really? There's just nothing here, huh? I put, like, the captain's... Yeah, okay. Yes, this is how that works. If I just put on the captain's glove, gloves, I will have his fingerprints. 
dexterity level five granted this feels incomplete is how this this path feels i think that's really it There's, I mean, there's nothing else here. All right, I guess, I guess we're done then. Oh, but now I don't. Yeah, like, now I don't have the key for this. You're lucky this song is so good. Kyle, Kyle tried to be nice, and it really didn't work out today. Funhouse puzzle wasn't broken, I think that would have been pretty cool. Also, I'm amazed at like all this text for these credits. Maybe I didn't edit this. I don't actually remember changing characters, just like actual text text. Yeah, okay. Albert Lim. Is that like a ZZT or something? Like, a lot of these names are ZZT or names. Alright, well. The end. Two endings down, both of which have involved me stopping aliens. One time, very malicious aliens, and another time, just sleeping ones. Boy, how's that for a first contact? I went onto an alien ship and did not interact with any of the aliens except to inject drugs into a sleeping one, and then I left. And now I'm waiting for them to take their revenge. There's some, uh, there's some, uh, issue there, I think. All right, that's, that's two down. That's an ending. I'm, I'm just wondering if something here is really gonna, like, wow me. Beyond the house itself. So far, it's... In the amusement park, the TV station. I wonder if I go to the, if I went to like the other TV station, if that would do anything. Or maybe that's a game over. I'm not sure. Now that's gonna do it for today. We'll be back again on Sunday, finishing up again. I keep wanting to call this fine arts quest. Finishing up Land of Traseal next Sunday at noon Pacific. I'm assuming we're finishing it, and then we will be back again. One more bonus Wednesday stream, some more Windcat Wednesday, whatever else I can come across on that old CD of mine. And then we'll go back to some more Code Red next Friday. Same time, 6 o'clock. See, maybe maybe ending number 3 will... Third time's the charm, perhaps. But thank you all for watching, thank you all for your support, thank you for your subscriptions and such today. Alright, that's gonna do it for today. Hope to see y'all next time. Thanks for watching. Later.